Hello! So, it's uh, nighttime and there's no sunlight, so all you get is the computer glare on my face. Um, so today I made some just clips of me walking to the train, being on the train, walking in the city. And if you've ever been to this city, you probably will recognize the city. But um, anyway, I thought it would be sort of interesting to see maybe like a, a little a little snippet of stuff that I see during the day. Um, and I'm probably going to do a couple of little voiceovers just because there's some things that I want to make sure to point out about the things that I was seeing. So I'll... Uh, probably see you at the end but maybe not all right here we go yeah yeah so you're probably going to see a lot of the Loch Ness thumb monster in this video because apparently I don't know how to use my phone uh, camera yet <laughs> uh here I'm crossing the street, which is obvious, but I just want to point out that I did look both ways, even though it's a one-way street. And I don't know if you've noticed the, the little guy that's walking ahead of me, but and I wish I would have got this, but notice he's got a bag. And there's a point where, and I'm looking at the tree because I love this tree, but there's a point where that little man was picking up garbage along the sidewalk, which was just amazing to me. Walking up the stairs, at the train stop. Got you a little picture of the danger high voltage. <laughs> and now we're, we're almost getting to the tunnel, which I love this part when I'm on the train, because, well, you'll see in a minute, when we transition from being elevated to be an underground that's probably my favorite part of the train ride but i really like uh the fact that there are trees along through here and just in general it's interesting to to sort of watch the different things go by probably won't say too much more here oh, except you get to see my reflection in the window And then it was really strange because they slowed down and they normally don't slow down right here. So I was sort of intrigued by the fact that they were moving so slow through this part. Really get a, a chance to see all the fantastic graffiti. That's probably why they slowed down, by the way, because there are people standing out. I always think about fight against the dying of the light when I'm doing this, when I'm on the train and during this part. And when those two big beams come up, you know it's going to be dark in a second. So this is a little interesting. Right off the train stop, this is an interesting little section between the buildings where they've done this uh, this little jungle-looking thing. But it's it's federal property, and I'm going to show you this sign here. And I, in a minute, you'll see. They warn you, and then this guy walks by, so I waited for him. 
but afterward, uh, hopefully you can hear me, but I say I, I feel touristy, just so you know. Oh, the thumb monster. I was talking really close to the phone, too. I wasn't talking loud, though. Now I talk about this building. It's a library. And it's got these really cool, like, flourishes on the end, but they're huge. They're huge. Oh, and this is a little donut truck. Isn't it cute? It's a baby donut truck. And that's my one of my coworkers walking with me. Uh, there's some chips that I saw today when I went to lunch. Thought those looked pretty cool. Oh, and then this is just in between the buildings beside where I work. I just thought that looked kind of interesting. All the jumble buildings. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow, maybe. Bye. Luna says, watch us on YouTube.